Now with established companies who perhaps have existing automation, uh, there's, there's often scenarios where you're reaching points of obsolescence, where you have safety concerns that were unaddressed in the original equipment, where that equipment is no longer supported by the, uh, the original manufacturer. Andrews Cooper's happy to engage and support you on your existing equipment and make a strategy and a plan for your capital budget over the coming years, how to address key bottlenecks within your manufacturing processes and how to make the most of your expenditure to ensure that you're addressing the critical aspects of your manufacturing uh, establishment. Now, there's not a lot of companies out there who are prepared to engage across the broad spectrum of existing equipment on your floor, uh, developing that, maintaining it, addressing obsolescence, so on and so forth, all the way through to complex developments for new products and adding that, uh, that design for manufacture expertise that we bring with our PD product development wing of, of Andrews Cooper. The, the, the critical component here is the life cycle of uh, products these days is ever diminishing, the complexity is ever increasing, and those two things are squeezing the development timeline, so you have to be addressing these things from a position of ambiguity. Whereas this would normally come once you had stabilization of your product design, uh, that's no longer the case. Uh, if you were to wait to that point, you would already be behind the curve and you would be late into market and risk losing market share. We can support that early engagement on incremental basis and support you all the way through your development life cycle to the point of uh, new product introduction when you need to then ramp, scale, and support that roadmap as well. So that's a third area of road mapping which is critical, is what your needs are today and not what your needs are tomorrow, and hopefully not what your needs are in three years' time. How can you leverage the funding that you have available to you to meet that product ramp as your product uh, reaches popularity within the market. So um, it's, it's often very complex balance of your suppliers, incoming components, how many of those you have available to do your development and test, how you want to uh, launch to perhaps a, a contract manufacturing partner, yet you want to maintain the integrity of the manufacturing equipment itself and keep ownership of that. We're happy to be your third party partner in that relationship, work with both your contract manufacturer where the equipment will eventually be located, all the way through the life of that equipment as well. So a very targeted plan of roadmap of automation can support you not only in existing manufacturing scenarios, new product introduction, highly ambiguous and fast paced environments, but also in your product ramps and a strategic spend plan for the first three, six, nine years of life of the product.